Good morning, ladies. <clears throat> Welcome back to Let This Rocker Room. It is 20 to 8 in the morning here in Arizona. And I have to get ready because we didn't make it to Sam's Club yesterday. But we're going to go today. But I thought I would dress this little girl up. I got this outfit from Cat and Jack. Actually, goes this way, and I love it on my Tobiah. So I thought I would try it on her now that she has the bigger body. Put some gray socks on with these little black patent shoes and this greenish gray bow. Can't really tell if it's green or gray. It might be gray. But anyway, it goes okay. So we got this girl fixed up. The um, matting came out good. And I worked on her arm. And pretty much all it really looks like now is peeling, a little bit of peeling skin. But that's okay. We're just gonna live with it. But we're gonna try putting this on her. Now I want to try to get out of here by 9 o'clock, so I want to go to the post office, get some things taken care of at the post office in UPS, and then Sam's Club is 45 minutes away, so I tried to put her hair in little piggy tails last night, but we may take that out. I need some more of those little clips. Her hair is so baby fine that it's kind of fly away and it's hard to style. But that's what my granddaughter's hair was like. It seemed like her hair was always in a ponytail. Ponytail or pigtails. And when she would wake up in the morning, her hair would be all over the place. One thing I want to share with you guys about the sealer is it has a very smooth feeling. It's not the textured feel, but I have been told you can get the textured feel if you want by adding. I don't want to tell you guys because I don't know if I'll get it right. You have to go over to Stardust and Moonlight nursery uh, I saved it and took a photo of it but something else you mix in with the sealer to give that textured feel but I don't want to I don't want to chance that I may have her a little overstuffed I don't know but she is cuddly and this is the 24 inch body so you guys can tell me what you think of that. I think it's the right body for her. I I did order a 26 inch, but I don't know. I think that might be too long. Either way, I want to keep her in a size that I still have clothes for. I don't want to be buying six to nine months now for this baby. I have a tendency to lean towards these little dresses and bloomers because they'll fit more than one size baby usually. So we'll get these little bloomers on. She's got chunky legs and arms. It was no wonder I kept putting tr trying to put zero to three on her and it didn't work at all. One of the things I've learned over the years with these onesies if you don't want them to be gapping up here, go a size smaller. I mean, this is a newborn that just stretched to fit her. I think on a newborn, I would even go preemie. But I like it better because it fits tighter around the neck. 
I'm feeling a little bit better today. I think we're gonna maybe, maybe go to Target to, I don't know, those little shoes I showed you guys last night. Um, see, the three to six fits are much better. Um, I think they're gonna be too big. I measured them with the other shoes I got, which I think are perfect. And they're maybe an inch bigger. So I think my baby's gonna be shipped out soon. She's all finished. I have to put her together, which means I gotta get more glass beads. So yeah, maybe I'm gonna skip Target today. I don't know. For right now, I'm just gonna have to use the clothes I have and put tights on my babies. She does need eyelashes still, but I'm waiting to, I have to put in an extra order. I need some blonde eyelashes. I mean, that's another thing that went wrong was I had to, I had to reset her eye because it fell out. And It's not set absolutely perfect, but it's close. And uh, if I tried to change it, I'm sure I would break it. They were especially hand blown and made by an artist that makes eyes. So, so if you get super glue on your babies, um, the goop, goop, goop off, the one that's citrus that takes off chewing gum and stuff, that will help to take it off. It's not a perfect solution, but it made her arm better. So she may just become a winter baby, but I put long sleeves on. I've never taken her out in public yet. I thought I might, I might do it today. We'll see. So check these shoes, they're gonna fit. These are zero to three month shoes. So here's the thing that happens with, they fit perfect. I'm always afraid to go out with shoes though because I'm afraid they will, I will lose one. <laughs> see, I have a couple threads I need to trim. Okay, let's see what we can do with her hair. I got this little case that I keep my hair products in and my brushes and powder for my silicone. If I ever get my silicone back, I haven't even thought about my silicone. I've almost forgotten I have a silicone. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'll be like getting a new baby if I ever get it back. I'm still drinking my coffee. I really like these kind of brushes because they don't pull on the hair. It will get the hair. Her hair, I have a hard time deciding what to do. It's, it's rooted very thinly, which looks fine for a baby but yeah, I, I don't know what, I can't really get it <laughs> to do much. I'm gonna try a headband today. I'm wondering if I should give her bangs, but I'm kind of nervous about trying to do that. And the headband is wanting to slip. 
I don't know. Her bangs don't seem to work on her very well either. They want to slip right off her head. I don't know what the answer is, baby, to your hair. I don't. You have a black bow here, maybe that'll go. Or a white bow. The problem I have with bows is they don't want to stay in her hair either. They're cute, but they don't want to stay. There she is, aunties. I think she looks way better, way, way better than she looked before. I'll tell you guys, waiting and body is everything. It really is. I keep putting this on because it makes it so silky. It is a little oily, but it kind of tames it and makes it really silky. I hope you can see her. She's sticking her finger up like she's saying, wait a minute here, I have something to say. I'm sure you guys can see her. So there she is, guys. Tell me what you think. I still think she has a very big head, but I don't know if putting her on a longer body is going to help that. Baby, some babies just have big heads, and she's got a big one. So it's kind of funny. Her arms are shorter than Maddie's, I think. Her legs are about the same length as Maddie's, I think. But wow, what a gigantic head. You gotta love those blue eyes. I'll talk to y'all later. You guys have a great day. I'm gonna try to have a great day. It will be good to get outside in the nice weather. It's probably gonna be perfect weather up by the river because uh, it's cool enough here that it's about 10 degrees warmer there than here. Where we're going is really the hot spot of the nation. In the summer, they get the hottest of anywhere in the United States so I don't go there in the summertime so you guys have a great week keep calm play with dolls and I'll catch you on the next one